All right, hello and welcome to another edition of TikTok Live at Retro Sports Games. Playing some baseball stars on the original NES with our created team, Ties Hall of Famers. Continuing our season-long created league facing the legendary American Dreams. We are at bat right now. It's Andrew Jones, our leadoff hitter. Popping up to center field at number one. We are facing Cy, pitching really well this year. The number two pitcher for the Dreams, 2.40 ERA. Manningly smacks one right back to Cy. Two quick outs. Bring up the three hold, Gary Sheffield. Oh, that was a check swing. Easy play for Cy. One, two, three, we go in the top of the first. American Dreams, a quality offense. Tons of guys who can hit the ball. Up and down. Leading off Pete, 479, six home runs. To face David Cohn, who has sparkling 0.81 ERA on the season. Drop pitch. Pete does not bite. Thought we might get him. Let's see if we go back to back droppers. We do. That one doesn't drop. Rip foul. Oh, right back, Mattingly. Thought Mattingly had a chance to stab that. He could not pick it up. Lead off man on. And a murderer's row coming up with Babe. 5-13, 16 home runs. He smacks one to center field. First two runners reach, and Cone is in immediate trouble. <laughs> Serge does not like this game. And to left field that goes. Things are falling apart for Cone quickly. Bases loaded, no outs. Hammer and Hank is up among the league leaders in home runs, RBI, batting average. And he pops up right on cue. Thurman Munson jumping for joy. Thank you, Serge. Things do not get easier with Lefty up. Oh, Cone busts him inside. Lefty pops up. Two foul pop-ups to Thurman Munson. Two quick outs here. See what Willie can do. 576, excuse me, 67, 16 home runs. Base is still full. Doc asked David Cohn. Absolutely. This is our team of borderline Hall of Fame players. Our created team. Guys like David Cohn. Full count. Two outs, bases loaded. The pitch, Willie stands there looking at a fastball that touches the inside corner. Cone gets out of the bases loaded, no outs, jam. Phenomenal pitching job. Dewey Evans smacks one to left field, one hops the wall. On his way to second base, going to be a close play. Oh, they got him. Great throw. Left field from Hank. Get Dewey Evans trying to st stretch that into a double. Rolling grounds out. Bringing up Thurman Munson, 416, three home runs. Slow roller. Second base, Pete has it. Easy play. One hit, no runs. Bottom of the second. The scale that short, long throw. Gets Jay by half a step. So Jax pops up, right field. Gonna be a long run for Evans. He will get there. Brings up Cy. 0-19 batting average. So that'll be one of the lowest batting averages you will see in this game. Does not help out his own cause. One, two, three, go the dreams. Heading to the top of the third. 512 Dre says, old school. Is this NES? It sure is. Classic NES. Baseball stars made by SNK. Diving play made by Jax at shortstop. Gold glove caliber play. 
that's Matt center field. Joe has it. And the offense is just not going here for Ty's Hall of Famers. Cohen here, 477 though, five home runs as a pitcher. The best hitting pitcher in the league. End of the bat, pass Jax, he has a base hit. Two out single. Surge laughing at the 019 average for Cy. Golf Pro, Sweet Lou, absolutely. He has struggled for us offensively, but done very well defensively. Slow roller, they cut him off at second base. Goose eggs all over the board. Headed to the bottom of the third. Chris Lake asks, RBI Baseball? No, this is Baseball Stars for the NES. Although RBI Baseball is a great game. Back to the top of the order. And Pete, 483. Oh, diving stop by Lou Whitaker at second base. Those kind of plays will be key against this phenomenal Dreams offense. Again, that one gets by Mattingly. Normally, Mattingly has a chance of stabbing those balls. Two of them has gotten by him. McGroob says lucky seven fight. We will see that when we get to the seventh inning. Popped up third base side. He's got a chance against the wall. Right along the tarps. It's Joe to pop up third base side. That one is high. Field. Sheffield has it. No score after three complete. The two best offensive teams by far in the league. Cannot score. Smacked into left field. This one's got a chance to get to the wall. One hops the wall all the way there. We're going to lead off single. Trying to get things going here. Break this scoreless tie. That was Don Mattingly. A long single to the left field. Fisted foul, third base side. Mattingly goes. The ball is through the gap between short and third. Two on. MV Polk says, Wiz Tecmo Bowl, Mario 3 on Mike Tyson's punch out. We play a ton of Super Tecmo Bowl. We played Tecmo Super Bowl all day yesterday. Dwight Evans. Side pitch, driven foul, third base side. Nick says, love it. My absolute favorite game as a kid. No one talks about it. Underrated. Sure is underrated. It's one of the great sports games of all time. Ripped, in, ripped into left field. Mattingly's going to try to score. He will get there. Sliding head first. one nothing ball game. Finally, the Hall of Famers break through the scoring. We have Scott rolling 492, 14 home runs. There it is, blasted, but hooking foul. Rolling, good, all of that one. Needs to straighten it out, 0-2. End of the bat. This one is going to head towards the wall, just in front of the warning track. Bring up the captain, Thurman Munson. This one's dumped into left center field. Will it fall? Yes, and it gets by Joe. All the way to the wall. Everyone keeps running. Another run will score. RBI double for the captain. Omar Vizquel up. Check swing. He did go around. Strike one. Swing and a miss. 0-2. Oh, one out. Two in scoring position. Oh, Vizquel could not get around on that one. Strikes out. Lou Whitaker just 3.07 on the season. No home runs. He does smack that one to the shortstop. Going to be a close play at first. Get some, Jax. Picked on the other end by Willie. We do score two. Two nothing after three and a half. Go Dogs ask, remember Tommy Lasorda baseball for Sega? Of course, one of the first great baseball games for the Sega. Wicked Main says it just busted out all my ROMs. The Kurg, best baseball game ever. I agree. I agree. Five rings, says he loves this game. Created a woman's team to make that money. I always like to put one female on my team. 
It's always fun to have that one created girl on my team. Drop pitch doesn't drop. Mattingly stabs that one, takes it unassisted. One away. Willie in the six hole batting four, 562. That was blasted left field. Does it have enough? High, deep, for the warning track. Just a long out. Cone continues to put up the zeros across the scoreboard. See if he can polish off Jay here. Skell has it. Quick throw to first. One hop to Mattingly. One, two, three, go the dreams. Pitcher's duel here. Two nothing after four. Dropper, Cone swinging a miss. Size delivery pops him up. Babe has it. Records the first out of the inning. The Krug says he used to build a weak team with tons of prestige just to whoop on them and grind money on my main. I did that too when I was young, when I had all kinds of time to build a team full of prestige. Could whip him up 10 nothing in one inning. The things we did as children. I never thought anybody else would do that. And I hear that all the time. The things I used to do when I played video games, everybody else did as well. Five Rings says, best game ever. Climb the wall and steal a home run. That is super rare, but always fun to do. I like when the guys sometimes fall over the wall. Schwinn says, this is my favorite game of all time. I can't believe I came across this. Make sure you give us a follow, Schwinn. Hit that follow button. We love playing baseball stars. Johnny is up. And a pinch hitting roll. Browns out to the second baseman, Whitaker. He's pinch hitting for Jax. But of course, they're going to leave Cy in there. About an 018. He's pitching very well. Soft liner. The scale has it. Two quick outs. Back to the top of the order we go. Today's World says he loved this game when he was a kid. Ninja Black Sox. Black Sox had a ton of speed. Good defense, too. It's blasted into right field. Evans there, though. And he has it. Cone continues to cruise through five. Two nothing. Thank you, guys, for all the follows and shares. As Dizzy comes on in relief. 484 ERA out of the bullpen. The righty delivers to Sheffield, pops it up. Dizzy under it, one away. Roy Lee loves this game. Popped up left field, gonna be a long, long run for Hank, but he will get there. The pitchers all continue to cruise. These are the, easily the two best offensive teams in the league. Pitching is dominating right now. Smacked into left field. Base hit all the way to the wall it goes. He hits first, round second. He will get in there safely. Tie for Life says Dwight Evans or Daryl Evans. This is Dwight Evans. Dwight Evans was one of my favorite players growing up for the Red Sox. This is a team made up of all borderline Hall of Famers. Although Daryl Evans, pretty good home run hitter in his prime. This one's gonna bloop in there. Gonna knock another run home. Three nothing ball game. Mo says game would always erase itself back in the day. Yes, that is why I'm playing on an emulator right now. I do own a Nintendo and a copy of this game, but I play on an emulator so I can save it all up every single time I play. I don't have to worry about things getting erased. Check on the runner, back safely. Five rings goes deep in the batter's box. When batting, I always went forward. I want to get ahead of the curveballs, I guess. Sometimes it is a detriment, though. They bust you in hard and you're not going to be able to pull it. Cone starting to slow down here. See if this is a thing to pay attention to. 1-2 count here on Babe. This might be Cone's last batter. Smacked left center field. Jones running hard. Can't get in there. Bloop single. That could be all for Cone. He is not going to face the heart of the order. 
They will bring in Dan Quisenberry in his 3.85 ERA out of the bullpen. Maximus says, I was disappointed with this console. Paperboy does not exist on my retro console. You can always download an emulator and a ROM if you want any game you want. Tie for Life says, Daryl Evans should be in the Hall of Fame and Jack Morris. Did Jack Morris make it in? I think Jack Morris did make it in the Hall of Fame a couple of years ago. Runner goes, soft throw. The pitcher grabs it, throws to second. He's safe. They got the man moving. He makes it to second base with two strikes. So it's popped up. Where's my infielder? There he is. Miss Gale has it. One away. Five Ring says he plays this on a knockoff console. Whatever it takes. Smacked on a line. That was driven to center field, but right at Jones, the center fielder. Let's see if Quisenberry can get out of this jam. Man on second, two outs. Dropper drops. Lefty goes for the bait. Swing and a miss. Dreams have yet to score. Top of the seventh, we go. Oh. Check swing, strike on Lou Whitaker. Still looking for his first home run on the year. That one does not have the distance. Jack's under it. That's a Johnny. That's Johnny at shortstop who came into pinch hit. Five ring says, I hate it when they cut off an infield throw. Sometimes if you get in the way, it spells trouble for your defense. Punisher asks, which RBI is this? This is Baseball Stars. Came out uh, about two years after RBI Baseball, if I'm not mistaken. After the first RBI Baseball, anyway. So the second baseman, that is out number three. I don't think there's been any home runs this game. Pitches have really pitched well. Quisenberry, slow roller. Roland has it. One hop to Mattingly. Rolling again. Two quick outs here in the seventh inning. Five, five rings says, beat the lovely ladies. We'll pay the lovely ladies next. A smack left center field. That one's got the height and the distance. Goodbye, baseball. Johnny in the eighth hole. He came on to pinch hit a couple of innings ago. He strikes one out of the park here. 3-1 ball game. Finally, the dreams are on the board. Popped up by Dizzy. Roland has it. Out of the seventh, 3 1. Tight pitcher's duel. Yo, Dog says, gonna love those one hoppers across the diamond to first base. Yes, if you don't reset your guy after you field the ball, meaning let, completely let go of your controller, basically, and then make the strong throw, then it's gonna be one hopped across the diamond every time. Most of my defensive players are pretty good as well, so. If it one hops, that means I did not reset my control to make that throw. Five Ring says, always get that money versus the ladies when you win. Absolutely, people loved watching that pink team play. Ty's Hall of Famer's got something going here. First and second, one out, Scott rolling up. To the bullpen go the dreams. They will go with Frank, 6-6-0 six, six, oh, on the season. Just over Johnny's head. One hops the wall. And the relief fails the dreams here. RBI double, second and third now. Farter says he loves this game. Change names to players in my team. That's always my favorite thing to do. Create my own team. Power them up. Go undefeated. So the second baseman throws home. But everybody's going to be safe. Bases are full of Hall of Famers. Vizquel smacks one into center field. One run in. He hits third. He's heading home. They will not throw it. Two runs in. 6-1 ball game. They've busted this game wide open. Whitaker right on cue. Pops up. He's in danger of dropping below 300 on the season. He'll be the only one in our lineup under 300. Is 
Kingsbury's up. He'll stay in there. He gets a hold of one. This pitcher can hit. High, deep. Goodbye, baseball. Dan Quisenberry, three-run blast for the righty. Submarine pitcher helping his own cause. This game is now a runaway. 9-1 ball game, top of the eighth. Frank has imploded. Five rings wants to 10-run rule him. It'll be a late 10-run rule, but we may get there. Top of the order, back up. Andrew Jones fists one center field. This one's got a chance to drop in front of Joe. It will. Andrew Jones on first. Red says, I don't think Dan Quisenberry ever hit a home run. I agree. I don't think he got many at-bats being a lifelong relief pitcher. Especially in the American League. I believe he pitched a long time for the Royals. We put up six. 9-1 ball game. Quisenberry will stay in there. Oh, nice grab by Whitaker. Dan the Dad says, God, this game was fun. Sure was. Never got old with all the features it had. Jones has that one. Captain Time likes it. Baconator says, hey there, can we see your Nintendo better? Is this your Nintendo or emulator? I actually have to shut the lights off. Or I'll put the, put the glare on my TV. That's why the lights are off. Diving play by Vizquel. One hop and Mattingly. I will change the light color in the back, though, to see if we can see the Nintendo better. I don't know if that can see it better. That sees it a little better. Denny comes on in relief. 482 ERA. I do own a Nintendo and the Baseball Stars game. However, I do play on an emulator just so I can save the league. I don't have to worry about it erasing ever. Dwight Evans, he's got a couple of hits today. That one goes all the way to the wall. He's tried to stretch one into a double earlier. This game got thrown out. This time, feet first slide, he's safe. One out double. Scott rolling to the shortstop. There you go. Try to get him at third instead of getting the sure route at first. A little running chicanery. First and third now. Runner goes. End of the bat. I'm going to assume that one's falling. It will. Two hops the wall. This will score two more. Officially, we are in 10-run rule territory. Of course, it's already the ninth inning. The Dreams get their last at-bats no matter what. So it will go the full nine. That one's on the end of the bat. Hank has it. We're going to try to get the sack fly. Oh, gets thrown out. Head first slide. Tried to stretch it out there. Gets thrown out at the plate. But this game is well in hand. Quisenberry stays in there. Roland has it. We'll go to second. And then on to first, and he is safe. Oh, that's going to spell trouble if the Dream score. Ah, oh, two on now. No outs. Quisenberry's going to try to stay in there. Get the save here. The three-inning save. But it's not without its struggles. Juan French says, GOAT baseball game. American Dreams, Dan and are possible to beat. My team is pretty good as we strike out Willie. I do not have an ultra-powered-up team. They're just very good players. A lot of guys in the 60s and 70s. So they're about equal as the American Dreams. I will admit, my pitching is very good, though. I like to have good pitchers, some good defensive players. Strikes him out looking again. Two strikeouts in the inning for Quisenberry. Johnny has the only run today for the American Dreams, a solo shot. Ugh. Knocks one into right field, bases loaded. Wisenberry's going to stay in there. He wants to save. He's facing Denny. It's really slowing down. Stanima is waning for Quiz. Slow roller, first base. Oh, Mattingly has it, but it's just foul. Dropper doesn't drop. End of the bat for Denny. Soft one to Vizquel. He has it. Ends the ball game. 11 to 1. We do pick up 18 hits. Dream score just one. Cone goes to 14 and 0. Cy picks up just his second loss. Two home runs. Johnny and Quisenberry. 
Two guys you wouldn't expect. Five rings likes it. 11-1, thanks to that big eighth inning, six runs. Quisenberry picks up his sixth save of the year. He leads the league, I believe, in that category. 41,000 in attendance. We pick up $80,000. Let's check the standings here. We'll get the other four teams to play their games so everything can be even. Everybody played 32 games. It is a 50 game season. You play every opponent 10 times. Right on cue, five rings asked how many game season? It's a 50 game season. 120 games. I didn't think I want to go that long, five rings. I don't think I want to play 120 games. Although I might next next time out I might try 100 games. So this is a 50 game season. We have 32 and 0. That is a bit deceiving though. We have had a ton of one, two, and three run games. A couple of extra inning games we've pulled out. We have been on the winning end of a lot of close games. If we flip those games, we'd have five or six losses. There are the league leaders, the top four hitters in the league, all for the American Dreams, all over 500. Look at those numbers. Absolutely unbelievable. You got Roger in there, too, for the Brave Warriors at 480. Yeah, five rings says, lovely ladies, 30 games out. Yes, what does what that reckon? Two and 30. They're two and 30. Surprisingly, look at the Ninja Black Sox, just 13 and 19. Normally, they are without a doubt the third best team, but the Brave Warriors have really taken it to them today, uh, this season. Joe leads everybody in home runs. Where's Joe in the bat now? Joe's there in the bat now. Willie has 550, so far above everybody. He's also got 16 home runs, not too far off the Triple Crown. Hank with 52 RBI, leads everybody by four. Sheffield and Vizquel for our team, the Hall of Famers, second and third. David Cohn loses his ERA to .76, absolutely unbelievable. Oral Hershey's were up there at 1.27. Of course, these are all starters. Usually the game defaults to having a two-man starting rotation. So most teams only have two guys up here if they do. Usually the relief pitchers will not garner enough innings to play. Drowning Fish, thanks for joining us. My favorite TikTok follower. Cone leads everybody with 14 wins, Oral 12. Sandy and Cy there at 11 and 10. No surprise, the two best teams have the four best pitchers. There is Dan Quisenberry leads everybody with six saves. <laughs> Uber says, we need a Metroid stream. I have to save those platformer games to somebody else. I played all the sports games growing up. That's what we do here at Retro Sports Games. We play the old school sports games. All right. Five rings. Did you say you wanted us to play the lovely ladies? Here we go. Laurel Hershey's around the mound against Leanne, the lefty three-quarter arm sling pitcher. Greg Bookman says Super Tecmo Bowl. We played a ton of Tecmo yesterday. All day. We face Leanne. She is a very respectable 4-4-4 ERA. She is without a doubt the star pitcher of this staff. That three-quarter arm delivery, unfortunately. Her defense and her offense fail her time and time again. Got a smacked high. Deep, that ball is carrying out of here. Quick lead for Ty's Hall of Famer as Don Mattingly goes off as a field. Two run jack against Leanne. Five rings says beat down coming. Sure is. Viking blood, good memories from my childhood. Always happy to bring back those memories. Left field, takes the inside pitch. Left field, Chris has it, one away. Leanne, the lefty, really busting the right-handed hitters inside. Five rings says 10 runs, ASAP. 
a sure bet we'll take him to 10 runs. Occasionally, though, our offense does sputter just a bit. I don't think today's the day, though. Center field. Dania has it. But we do score two on the two-run jack from Don Mattingly. Roy says, when making a team, why does the team have the name of a team called What is a Wren? You know why, because that's a bird. Popped up, third base side. Roland makes the easy play. We're going to see some very low batting averages, I think. Linda, 142 at second base. She pops up. Roland jumps for joy. Cheryl, respectable 300 with seven home runs. She is the best hitter of the lovely ladies. Ooh, she smacks one foul. First base side. Viking Blood said, you ever play sports stock baseball on Genesis? I have played it. I should bring that to my live. A lot of people like that game. Joe Montana, uh, excuse me, Joe Montana sports stock football too was a great game. Cheryl strikes out looking. At the top of the second we go. Trey says, is this game before RBI Baseball? No, this came out about two years after RBI Baseball. End of the bat to the shortstop Hong. Long throw. She gets him. Bring up Omar Vizquel. That one blooped into right field. Past the right fielder. Cheryl goes all the way to the wall. Vizquel hits second. He's on his way to third. He will have a stand-up triple. Gator says, do you play Blades of Steel hockey? We have played Blades of Steel. One of the great early hockey games of all time. Hit the pass! Hit the pass! Of course, the fighting and the fast-paced action made Blades of Steel the great hockey game. Much better than ice hockey, in my opinion. Corey says, Ken Griffey Jr. Baseball for the SNES was always his favorite. Chris at 339, three home runs. I have Ken Griffey Jr. baseball for my Game Boy. Chris did not want to take a bat off her shoulder. It was a Daniel who smokes one left field. Are you kidding me? Goodbye, baseball. Down the line it went. Daniel got a hold of that pitch. Drives it and cuts the lead in half. My goodness. A surprise from the lovely ladies' offense, Dania, the solo shot to left field. Wow, Oral Hershazer cannot like that. Came in with a 1.27 ERA. Gives up a home run to the lovely ladies. The pink hats are going crazy. Uber says, do you consider Mutant League football a sports game? I sure do. Doesn't matter if it's a fantasy game. That definitely was a real game. Real sports game. <laughs> Jay Black says, the league of their own on the NES. Yes. And Gina Davis just took me deep. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. So I'm going to miss. Down we go. Leanne has really settled in after that home run to Mattingly. But here is Donnie Baseball up again. Trey Lucas says, Jordan vs. Bird was a classic too. I had Jordan vs. Bird for the Apple II computer. Back in the day, soft liner to second baseman. Corey says he loves the home run derby mode on Ken Griffey Jr. Wow, Leanne just busting the righties in big time with that fastball. Uh oh, that's on a line all the way to the wall. Hits the bottom of the wall on one hop. That'll be extra bases. Chris gets over there very slowly. That's a two out double. Gary Sheffield. Bringing up Evans. Trey says the Apple II, that's a classic. My stepmother has that Apple II still in the attic somewhere. She saves everything. Also have the original Madden game for the Apple II computer. Evans goes down on strikes, and the lovely ladies are just staying in this game. 
Making the Hall of Famers look very bad right now. We put up 11 last game against the American Dreams. We're struggling against the lovely ladies here. Corey Barrow says it was a basketball game before NBA Jam. I think it was Basketball Superstars. Fun early SNES game. Uber Minnesota, uh, Minneapolis says I like Robot Wars or whatever that game, baseball game was with Robot. You are right. Uh, Base Wars is what it was called. All the close plays, the two robots would battle over who was out or safe. Swing and a miss. Down goes Leanne. Top of the order with Gina, 123 average. She smacks one, two, rolling. Long throw. Across the diamond to Mattingly. One, two, three, they go. Still just two, one after three complete. Hall of Famers really need to bust this one open. That one's between the shortstop and third baseman. Leadoff single. Viking Blood says he loves Little League World Series, also made by SNK, so that's why it has a lot of similarities with baseball stars. TSS's Bases Loaded was a fun game for Nintendo, too. Of course, if you wanted to play Bases Loaded, you always had to take the team that had paced the unbelievable best offensive player ever in baseball, video game baseball. Slow roller, that was a check swing. Try to go the long way to second base. Everybody safe. Defensive miscue for the ladies there. Two on. Nobody out. That one's hammered but foul. Left field. Vizquel looking to go deep. Oh, swing and a miss. Again, Leanne really busts these righties in. Ooh, close. Into the bat, left field. This one's going to be a tough play for the left fielder. She will get there, though. Nobody can advance. One away. Lou Whitaker up. Just 296 on the season for Whitaker. Swinging a mess. He's in danger of losing his starting spot. Comes up big here, though. Sneaks it past Hong. Another run will score. Flip says, this is my base favorite baseball game. As Leanne finally starts to have her stamina. Weaken. The hitters are just waiting on her now. Oral's up, trying to help his own cause out. Oh, and he pops up to the catcher. Susan has it. Lovely ladies just do not want to go away here. Close 3-1 ball game. Oh my goodness gracious. Pops another one up. Just one run scores. 3-1 three three ball game. Linda. Two Scott rolling. I'll jump up and grab that one. Put on a fancy defensive show for the fans. Manley takes that one unassisted. Two quick outs here. Left field it goes. Long run. Sheffield on the run. Three pitches, three outs. Finally, a relief pitcher coming in. They'll bring in Grace. One of the few pitchers without a 9 ERA. 6.91 on the season. She has a lefty softball style. First pitch driven. High. Deep to the wall. Just clears the wall. 4-1 ball game. Ladies have kept it close long enough. Mattingly, that's Mattingly's second home run of the game. Hall of Famers really want to bust this one wide open here this inning. That one on a line to the wall. It's the middle of the wall. That'll go for a very long single as the throw comes into second base. Hit that follow button if you haven't already done so. Try to get our way to 10,000 followers. Five rings, laughing at the crying on the mound from Grace. Trey Lucas is, says, is this Baseball All-Stars? Baseball Stars was the name. 1989 from SNK. Give that one a ride. 
<laughs> that runner goes all the way back to first. Going to head towards second. Tagging up on the long drive to center field. Scott rolling an even 500. That one is hooking foul. Off the wall. Umpire right on top of that call. Third base side. Third base miss has it. Tries to get him out at first. Everybody's safe. Tried to look the runner back, but they're going to end up with first and third. Thurman Munson, end of the bat. They go home with it, and again, everybody's safe. Defensive miscue. Ladies try, should have tried to turn the double play to end the inning there, but they do not. And it pays off for the Hall of Famers. That's driven left field. They'll score at least one on the sack fly. Make it a 5-1 ball game. Lou Whitaker says RBI last inning. Cannot do any more damage here. He pops up. Susan under it. That'll end the inning. B. Cope says, so you can't hit. You just take advantage of the computer glitches that it has with throwing. Oh, taking a pot shot at me. Easy play for Omar. First base. Susan, slow roller. Manley takes an unassisted two quick outs here in the bottom of the fifth. Bringing up Emma. Shallow center field, long run. Jones has it. 5-1 ball game after five complete. The only hit so far is the solo shot from Dania. Off Oral Hershiser. Lazy fly ball. Falls harmlessly out of play. Third base side. Oral trying to help his own cause out. 304 on the year. That one smacked down the third base side. Oral can move a bit on the bases. He's going to have a double here. Stroggy Love says RBI is still the best baseball game. A lot of people love RBI. Of course, it had the MLB players licensing agreement. So you can play with your favorite player, which made the, that was the best part of the game. Hershizer can score on this one. He will head first. He's in there. 6 1. Manningly's already got a pair of homers this game. That one's to third. Taking advantage of the miscue again. First and third. Gary Sheffield, no outs. That's the relief pitcher, Grace. Underhand delivery, foul. High and deep, but hooking foul. He was way ahead of that one. Sheffield, 17 home runs on the year. Looking for number 18. No, but this one gets into left field. He'll knock in a run. 7-1, finally. Things are starting to get going for the Hall of Famers. Another one. Past the third baseman. Ooh, gets past the left fielder all the way to the wall it goes. One run in. Hits third. He's going to see if he can score. Throw home. Ooh, not going to get there. Head back to third base. Ooh, safe just under the tag. That one's past the second baseman. That one goes all the way to the wall. That'll knock in two more. Finally hit double digits. 10 run ball game. Excuse me, 10 to 1 ball game. Munson has it. That one should bloop in there. It will. That'll be another run. Oh no, and they throw it away. I don't think anyone's going to get that one. We'll stay on third base. Let's see if somebody can pick up that RBI at third. It will be Viscal, and things are really falling apart for Grace and the lovely lady defense. What ails you? Oh, if Lou Whitaker gets a hit against you, you know you're in trouble. First and third now. Lou Whitaker has been struggling big time at the plate. Picks up a base hit. Orals at bat. We'll bring in a pinch hitter. We'll go with. 
Dale Murphy off the bench. Perfect 1,000 and very limited at-bats. He pops up to the shortstop. Finally get the first out of the inning. Top of the order we go. Runner goes. We'll have second and third. Take away that force of that second. <laughs> Van Neal, 8-2-6 as the girls can't play. They are struggling right now. They made it close through the first three or four innings, however. Even picking up a run against us. PJ Kirk says he saw us playing yesterday. Broke out his NES and started his franchise up again. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Throw comes home. <coughs> We're going to be pegged at home. We'll head back. Load those bases up for Donnie Baseball. That one's soft one. Right field. Nobody's going to get there, though. I thought that ball was going to be caught. That's a bloop RBI single. 13-1 now. Kirk says this game was ahead of its time. It sure was. Create a player mode. Create seasons. Keeping stats. All in 1989. Slow roller. Safe at home. Everybody moves up 90 feet. And the onslaught continues. Dwight Evans. This one's in the left field. 90 more feet they move up. One run added. Five Ring says, always thrown to the wrong base. They are. Their defense has not been good. They're finally going to peg us out at home. On to first. Can't pull the double play. Bringing up Munson. Finally two outs this inning. 71 mile an hour strike inside corner. Munson pops up. That'll mercifully end the inning. We put up a 10 spot, go up 15 to one. We'll bring in Tommy John, 4.09 ERA. They'll go with a pinch hitter for Hong, bring in Rachel. We will not waste any time. Let's see if we can hit Rachel, send her crying. Oh no, she pops it up. Oh, diving play, Scott rolling in fall territory. Grace is up. She's batting 333, limited at bat. So I'm going to go to Jocelyn on the bench. Empty in the bench here in this blowout ball game. That's popped up. Viscale has it. Johnny says, Is this bases loaded one? No, this is baseball stars. Worked foul. Out of play. Gina in her 122 average. Two strikes. Drop pitch, swing and a miss, the end of ball game. 15 to one, called game. Thanks to a huge 10 run sixth inning. Leanne, poor girl, came into the game with an ERA under four and a half, which is not too bad in this offensive minded league, but she drops to one and 15. Oral 13 and 0. Dania, as you see, picked up the only run for the lovely ladies. Five rings, likes the beat down. We do pick up 96 Gs. 48,000 people watch the game. Packed house. Ninja Black Sox almost beat the dreams. All right, that will put everybody at 33 games, I believe it does. We are in the lead at 33 now. Poor lovely ladies, 2 and 31 on the year. Checking out the stats again. Willie leads everybody at 545. Joe leads some home runs with 20. Hank at 57 RBI, although Sheffield on his tails at 50. Cone, 076 ERA. She, Leanne, actually came into the game sixth in the league in ERA. Not bad at all. And that will do it for us tonight. Thank you guys for joining us as we played some baseball stars on the old school NES. Please hit that follow button for us. Give us a follow. Stay up to date on all our feed, on all of our TikTok live games. We love playing baseball stars. RBI, Double Dribble, Tecmo Super Bowl, all the classics. Thank you guys for watching. Hit that follow button.